If a cat dies when laying on a heating pad will it catch on fire? No, the heating pad isn't on high enough heat for anything to catch fire. They sell heating pads with auto shut off. Hook your girl up, then she can feel comfortable that if the cat does happen to pass on the pad. Not likely, they typically hide when it's their time. It will shut automatically after a period of time. ETA I think even with a normal pad. It's not a high risk. My suggestion was just for peace of mind. Why would it catch fire? My cat died in her heated bed. Nothing happened and it was 12 hours before we got home and found her. If it were going to catch on fire, it already would have. It being alive or dead wouldn't matter. How? If anything it'll be less likely to catch fire as the cat isn't producing any heat. There's a logic thing happening here that needs to be pointed out. If you believe a dead body will catch on fire sitting on a heat pad, then you must believe the only thing stopping a heating pad from setting anyone on fire is that. They get too hot and get up before it can happen. Which is a wild risk for a company to take. If it wouldn't happen when the cat's alive, it won't happen when it's dead. Death doesn't make cats suddenly flammable. If you let the body rot and seep into the electrical components I guess you could get a short circuit. But even then I'd just expect it to trip your circuit breaker. Not catch fire. No, what you'll be left with is a very dehydrated kitty corpse sad face. Not a scientist but I learned that each substance has a smoke point, which I learned when wondering why parchment paper in a cookie sheet does not catch fire in a 325 degrees Fahrenheit oven. So maybe you can find out the approximate smoke point of cat fur of whatever the heating pad is made of and the flooring material underneath the pad. This way some numbers can get attached to the probabilities. Anyone more scientific than I ready to jump in here and offer numbers? Similar question will all of the oxygen be sucked out of my enclosed room if I leave the fan on? Overnight? If this was a thing there would be a thousand stores of drunks igniting while passed out. I'm surprised. If she is afraid of it setting the cat's dead body on fire. Why isn't she afraid of the heating pad burning her cat to death? Point that out to her. It will either 1. Freak her out more 2. Have her realize she was being silly No, it won't. I guess I can see where the fear comes from. Because a cat's fur could be flammable. But as long as the heating pad isn't getting obscenely hot. Like, hot enough to cook food. And the wires aren't frayed. It should be fine. If it's hot enough to cause a fire it's probably too hot for a cat. Maybe you could get her a self-heating cat pad. It retains their body heat and gets all warm and cozy with no risk. Nope, it is not hot enough. You can test this yourself. Put a piece of chicken on a heating pad and wait for it to catch fire. You could put some unlit matches on the heating pad and crank it up. And I doubt the heating pad would get hot enough to ignite the matches. And if it can't ignite a match then it can't ignite a cat. Not to rain on anyone's parade here. But I suggest that you use a power strip with a circuit breaker to power the heating pad. When a person, or animal, expires. They will usually evacuate their bowel and bladder. Urine is conductive. And if the cat has clawed the heating pad, it may not be waterproof anymore. It might be considered unlikely. But a fire caused by a short circuit is certainly a possibility. Dying does not make a cat more flammable. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Aircast is like doom scrolling for your ears.
Please like, share, and subscribe.